Hello, my name is Tony Sinanis, and I'm a lead learner here at Canning Ag Elementary School, and I'm super excited to be coming to you with our latest video update. It is a special Thanksgiving update, which is a new tradition we started last year. What makes this video update special is that it doesn't feature our amazing, awesome kids. Instead, it's going to feature our amazing, awesome teachers and all the wonderful learning that they help facilitate. So hold on to your seats, because it is going to be the best video update ever. All right, our first update comes from our amazing kindergarten team. So what's going on in kindergarten, people? Welcome to kindergarten. <laughs> gobble, gobble. <laughs> There's so many interesting things going on in kindergarten. We're so excited to tell you. All right, first, in writing, the children are learning how to write so many new words by using a magic rubber band to stretch them out. Happy Thanksgiving. I love it. <laughs> And in reading, we are learning that we are super readers. We have powers, and these powers are helping us become even better and stronger readers. We have pointer power, we have picture power, and um, we are reading, reading, reading. And we just want to give a shout out to our Caniac community. We are so grateful that you share our little ones, your little ones, with us every day, and they've become our little ones too. So happy Thanksgiving from the kindergarten team. Happy Thanks. Thanksgiving. Thank you, kindergarten team. All right, next up we have our amazing grade three team. So why don't you kick it off for us, Mrs. Monjovi? Okay, so in math, we're finishing bar modeling and your children have done a fabulous job with problem solving. And we're moving on to multiplication. So please make sure they study those facts. Let's review facts. All right, Mrs. Moore, what's going on? In reading workshop, we're talking about how readers need grit um, and mm -hmm. we're learning some strategies on how to tackle tricky words. All right, Mrs. Burrow, what's going on in writing? In writing, we're telling our true stories about things that have happened in our lives and learning to revise them using some of Brian Hines' strategies for improving our writing. We love Brian Hines. And Mrs. Rubenberg, would you wrap it up for us? Sure. We are so thankful for our Jericho community and how they're supporting the future <laughs> All right. of our birth of our children. Thank you so much for your kind words and your well wishes. Thank you. Happy Thanksgiving! Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. All right, next up, our amazing fourth grade team. Mrs. White, why don't you kick it off for us? Hello, Kenny and community. Um, in science, we have been studying weather. Uh, we have also been uh, producing uh, innovation projects projects the kids created these very cool uh, 3d glasses uh, that were awesome and we're moving on <laughs> in math uh, we're wrapping up our unit on division and problem solving awesome in social studies we've been learning about the iroquois and the algonquin and doing a lot of hands-on projects including making longhouses and wigwams <laughs> i love a good wigwam <laughs> In writing, we're doing lots of poetry, we're generating a lot of ideas, and the kids are becoming poets. Well, we just have to say thanks to all the parents for their support. Without the partnership that goes on here, we would never be able to accomplish all the amazing things that we do at Caniac. So thank, thank you. you. Thank Happy you. Thanks, thanks. All right, next up is our most adorable and amazing <laughs> second grade team. So, Mrs. Martin, can you kick it off for us? Sure. In math, we are working on bar models. We are using our reading skills of visualization to help us decide if we are adding or subtracting in two-step bar models. Nice. In round two of our writing workshop, we're focusing on our poetry unit. The kids are learning that when you write poetry, you see the world through a poet's eyes. It's awesome. In social studies, we're working on various aspects of communities rural communities, urban communities, and communities just like where we live here in suburban communities. Communities are fun and we love learning all about them. It's awesome. And we would just like to wrap it up by thanking everyone in the community for being so awesome, our PTA family, and everyone in Jericho, Westbury, Old Westbury. We love you and we thank you for sharing your children with us. Thank Go Canada. Happy thank Thanksgiving. You. Thank you. All right, fifth grade, what's happening in your classrooms? Well, in math, we just started a unit on fractions. In writing, we just published our personal narratives. In reading, we're beginning to talk about mood and tone in a book. And the fifth grade is thankful for working in a place where people care. We care about each other, and we care about our students. Happy Thank you. Awesome Happy job, fifth grade. All right, first grade, what's going on in all the learning happening in your classrooms? In Reader's Workshop, we're growing as readers and we're working on making text-to-self connections while reading independently and sharing our opinion. And in Writer's Workshop, we're just about to start our new unit on functional writing. Thank Happy, you. Happy Thanksgiving! Thank you. We hope you all enjoyed that update. Thanks again and Happy Thanksgiving to our amazing community.